The efficacy or the success rate for Nissen fund duplication is actually quite good. And we know that when we look at the long-term studies out as far as 10 years, we can expect between 35 and 65 percent of people who undergo this surgery to remain asymptomatic and off of medication. However, the remainder of that group will be back on medication within a three to five year period typically, although their symptoms will still be better controlled than prior to having surgery. The options, once you have a Nissen fund duplication, if your reflux returns again, can be either the repeat of the Nissen fund duplication, which is often avoided because the complication rates are higher during the repeat, Performing a different procedure, known as a Ruin Y procedure, which is a complete rerouting of stomach and intestinal tract to avoid reflux. Or, more commonly these days, is we perform an endoscopic therapy, known as a Streta procedure, whereby we will then work on the internal sphincter of the lower esophageal sphincter to then help bolster the prior effect, even though it may be failing at this time, of the Nissen fund application on the external sphincter.